Okay, hello there ladies and gentlemen, it's part four of my Max Payne 2 Let's Play. It's a new session of the game today, Sunday night, bank holiday Monday tomorrow, so I've got a bit of extra time to play this. But I have forgotten the controls because I wasn't... So, well, I've had a break from the game obviously. Is the audio okay here? Some of the dialogue in this game, just like the first game, when the characters don't know you're there. Your place or mine, Jesus. She. You're jealous. Hey, yeah. Okay, I'm getting controls wrong, girly dolls. What that's just it. What you don't see is that we are working here. This is a pro setup, top of the line. This isn't something to joke about. This isn't just a costume party. Let's take golf night. Believe me, without going into details. Hey! Hey! Uh... They're cleaning other apartments as well. Corcoran said that other inner circle members live in the building. It's quite amazing, this area, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, look at this sick Windows 98 setup, man. Yeah! Found a Lace. body, Whoa. a thin guy in a suit. Not Corcoran. He's a big man. Fat. Well, that's what happens when you don't know how to heal. For the love of Christ, ladies and gentlemen. What is the heal button again? Is it? It's that. I didn't really need to even do that. It won't be the last time I do this. I RIP to the bank manager. Oh yeah, we're going outside. Probably so. Thank you. Squeaky clean. I like that in these older games where you can <laughs> hear that delay of the audio change as you enter into a different area. Nice attention to detail there, Max holding his hand to his left ear as he's speaking to Mona. Nothing here. Check upstairs. Well done. I'm going upstairs. Zip it down. Papers, photos, everything needs to go. This place needs to be cleaner it's ever been. Kaufman's orders. If and when the CSI crew gets here, it needs to look like a black hole. Shut the fuck up. Oh, how did you shoot me? Okay, after an extra grenade, that's fine. Take cover! Oh! Quite a homoerotic thing to say, my friend. But each to their own, I'm gonna figure out with that. Well, what a shit show. I've really got to stop just lobbing grenades and molotovs at absolutely everything, but the only reason it's happening is because it's set to such a dumb button, the Y button. We've sorted out the aiming now, ladies and gentlemen. Yesterday, I didn't have auto aim on. I've had to turn it on just because the sensitivity. You can't tweak the sensitivity on this game. Um, but you can on the first Max Payne. That totally doesn't make sense. We're late. He's dead. You need to get out of there. We need to leave now. More cleaners in the lobby coming your way. I wasn't ready to go. Not without a single piece of evidence. In the photo, a group of men posing in front of a manor house. Corcoran was there. Senator Gate was there. So was Alfred Woden. So it was true. All bets were off. The inner circle was involved. Damn, another fallen bank manager, man. 
Dropping like flies. Crazy motherfucker. Whoa. Hey ya. This game's gameplay is so improved, man. Let's get the clutch knock off out. Everything just feels a little bit quicker, nicer, cleaner. Feels like I'm singing Daft Punk. Shit. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, <laughs> shit. Oh my god, there's a there's a fly in my bedroom. What the? I don't know if it's a fruit fly or... It's uh, obviously late August now, we're getting into September, so... They're dying off and they're going to frenzy and just go ape shit. Maybe that's what's going on here. That guy just did a tears for fears there, ladies and gentlemen. Head over heels. Would you love to see it? It's a dead end. Next time I play this game, and honestly the Max Payne games, they're good enough for me to return like once a year. Totally wouldn't mind returning to this game again. I want to play on the piano and a long goodbye. Lads, you're freaking asking for it. Music's back. Make the jump to the balcony below. Not too keen on the mollies on this game. I don't know if they've nerfed them. Or if it's just me being shit, but... Max? Ding! Yo, that's how Michael Acker felt from Orpeth on that piano. Damn! you! Ding, 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 ding. Lords and ladies. I'm going down on the balcony, is that right? Uh, is it it? Uh, oh shit, what's this? Ding, ding, ding. Just say the game, so. Uh, that's where we were, right? No, it isn't. This isn't where we were. Everything okay up there? Something's gone wrong. I just know it. I Captain told you Baseball already. Bad we're Boy. much better off than they were. They were on a stakeout when it happened. Stakeout wears you down. It numbs you. Then when you have to... There! Yeah, yeah. Ding, 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 ding. Whoa, we've only been recording eight minutes. Feels longer. I don't like the fact that the shotgun... Oh, nice, got the physics on the door. Whoa! Woo! Come on, that shotgun should do insta-kill damage. We do this a little later with Mona telling us where enemies are coming from and stuff, and we take control of her. It's probably one of the harder parts of the game. Some nice body bags laying around the apartment. Whoa, those such those seats don't look comfortable. Whoa. Go to the drop 
around the Queen's apartment and down the stairs. It's gonna be a long walk down this way. I'm working on it. Down the stairs. Do I hear a camera? Metal Gear. Down, 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 down. Down, 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 down. Another bank manager. In cold blood, ladies and gentlemen. So this isn't where we were before. Well, there's no bodies laying everywhere, so I guess so. Wow, this game is so much easier than Max Payne 1. Man really needs to play this on a harder difficulty next time. Definitely going to, I'm going Starting to do so. Sound like a broken record here. More cleaners to the right, in the lobby, behind the door. Thanks. Address unknown continues. Man, I really wish I could watch these, but I just want to get into the gameplay. Like I keep saying, I'm playing the game for the first time. Please listen to all of them. The one direction that I didn't look at. Yo, did someone just say one direction? The greatest band ever. I'm out of ideas, Max. I'll check the apartment the cleaner was guarding. Good idea, Pan. They're a minimalist. Why would I risk my life on a window cleaner's list when I can use the elevator? I don't know. For fun. The thrill of it. Hey! Hey! Oh! Get shot on me! Isn't it? Killed him. Nice. Fizz X, ladies and gentlemen. Mona, I found a window cleaner's lift. I'm headed down. Max? Yeah. Mona? Mona? Mona! It's such a gothic name, man. It's just perfect for this game. Down there, he's gonna get away. Say hi to the pavement, sucker. Please stop throwing grenades. Oh, that's bullshit. Oh, what the... Where the fuck did he come from? Oh, my lord. Pain to the max. Oh, and a close-up of an intriguing area. Oh, well, that makes it a lot easier. Down there, he's gonna get away. Say hi to the pavement, sucker. That was very camp. Are you aware of that? Down, 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 down. Down, 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 down. Nothing had worked out as planned. I had to find another way down to the lobby. Nice color of curtains. Yo, what a sick PC setup. I'm gonna play some Sims on that bad boy. A Windows XP. Wait. 
with a slow mo into a slow mo jump. Wow, I don't think I got him, but I did. A lot of corners here, even though there's also a lot of open areas. So I'm finding it easy to cheese them. Oh damn, this guy's got a cap on. Kaufman, you schmuck fuck. Find him. Take care of him. That's very loving. Oh no. I was caught in two mines then. Oh. Oh, from the rear? These guys have got a little bit more HP. Especially. If I remember correctly, Kaufman, yeah. I think I spoke about this in Max Payne 1. I don't like it in games like this, which are really kind of grounded in reality. Ooh, you piece of shit. Where human enemies have unrealistically large amounts of HP. Having said that, the sniper ended him in two shots, but I think I remember Kaufman having more HP. The physics of the enemies like <laughs> fall into the death so much better. What the? <laughs> the man with 10 IQ. Shit gameplay from myself though. though. Well, hey, I'm having fun again. Look at the bodies on the floor. Let them hit the floor. We're drowning in the pool. Um, I guess we're going in the elevator. Rock out with some Ingrams, ladies and gentlemen. I really could do. With some grenades and mollies. I felt being, for being a freaking moron that I don't have any. Why had she come to me in the first place? For help? For something she wasn't telling me? NYPD, freeze! Easy! Don't move! Pain, what are you doing? What are you doing? The million dollar question I didn't have the answer to. -na -na -na. What were you thinking? Were you thinking at all? I was following a lead. She was helping me. She is a fugitive murder suspect, for Christ's sakes. I was trying to save those people from the cleaners. The two cases are connected, mine and Winterson's. Senator Gate was killed by the cleaners. They are connected. Winterson can have them both. She doesn't back you up. I was doing my job. I'm sorry to do this, Payne, but it's for your own good. Hand me your guns. I'm putting you to a desk job. Start by writing a report on what the hell happened on the Upper East Side. Fraternizing with the enemy, I had stepped over the edge. The cartoon moment when the gravity waits for the coyote to realize his mistake before the plunge. Oh. Get yourself to a counselor. You're falling apart. When you're ready to go to AA, come talk to me. Get your act together. And get someone in here to help me with this mess. I was mad at myself, at Pervora, at Mona. Was she worth this? So we spend quite a lot of time here. Um, you can potentially just talk to everyone here. And I were you, I'd go to my desk and at least pretend I was doing as I've been told. Mate, if I was you, I would get rid of that 1985 haircut. Yeah, there's a lot of interactivity here, if I remember correctly. Fuck you, Winterson. Even though you're completely in the right. <laughs> it was all connected. The murder of Senator Gate, the cleaners, the inner circle, Vinnie Gogniti. I had to make Winterson see it. Winterson's phone was ringing. She wasn't at her desk. 
Winterson's phone. Better get Winterson. She's been kind of edgy about her calls. I think she's in the interrogation room getting a statement from a witness. Didn't she used to have the hots for you, Payne? I hear she has a new boyfriend. Getting laid would do her good. Talk about pants. She They say she kicked out her husband a couple of years ago. Been taking care of her blind kid on her own. No wonder she's edgy. You can also listen to this story here. We found you out of it on the covered in blood, burying the pieces of your wife and <laughs> guy under a rose bush in the back. This is quite funny. But it goes on for quite a long time. And by the looks of it, they had been shot in your bed. The murder weapons have your prints all over them. And you said you didn't do it. Hell no! I'm a fall guy! I've been framed! It's a setup! I was getting too close to the truth, so they had to get rid of me. Long story short, though, ladies and gentlemen, I think he did it. Number one, thank you. You may step back. They can't see you through the glass. <laughs> Just take your time. See if you can recognize any of them, okay? Yeah, okay. Number two, step forward and speak the line you were given. Why are those hookers still wearing the clothes like that? Read. Just say the line number one said. You think I was listening? You are nothing but a one-armed bandit. <laughs> Stupid. You're nothing but a one-armed bandit. Thank you. Step back, number two. Number three. You are nothing but a one-armed bandit. Aren't I supposed to identify any of the men in jumpsuits? That's none of your concern. Just concentrate on the task at hand. Do you recognize any of them? Yeah, number three's the one. Thank you. Okay, we're done. Take them away. Okay, ladies, you heard her. This way. Don't know if you actually have to do you this, Oliver. You can just go downstairs. Someone will come to get you once the paperwork is done. I tried to help you, Max, but you didn't listen. Now it's too late. This is important. It's too late, Payne. <laughs> Don't let the door hit you on the way out, Winterson. <laughs> I wanted to talk to Winterson. I don't think this woman's fit for the job. Never mind me. With him. I was on your side, Max. Doesn't matter now. You made your choice. You had it your way. I'm busy, Max. Go away. Detective Payne, anything you'd like to add? As I was trying to tell the other detectives, the place was crawling with guys in grey overalls. They sure as hell weren't cleaning the place, but she wasn't too keen on listening to me. It's hard to say who was out to kill who, but the chick I just fingered and the men in jumpsuits, they got into a serious firefight. Okay, thanks. They're taking the fall, both of them. Payne was with her when she was arrested. Who are you talking to? You're leaking information. Bravura's too soft on you. I was informing the proper authorities on what they should know. Stay away from my case, Max. Stay away for your own good. Everything had started out as black and white. Somewhere down the road, the line went blurry. The colors started to run, got smudged and gray. Winterson had been above my suspicion. It felt like a goodbye. This shit's getting crazy. Not the one or two other things we can do, but... I do believe this is the end game to go down here. The lineup was done. Mona was back in her cell. The cells were downstairs. One thing that annoys me in this game, I was going to mention it in yesterday's session near the start of the game when he first said the name, but the way that Max pronounces Vinny Cogniti's surname is different in this game. It's Cogniti in the first game, Cogniti in this second game, and I do not like that. It should be Cogniti. I wouldn't know. Just press the buzzer by the door. Petersburg will buzz you in. But maybe they realized a statement from one of your customers. It shouldn't be pronounced like that or something, but Mona Sachs. The last pokey down the corridor to your left. What here? Yo, oh, the crackhead. Oh dear. <laughs> not again, Jesus, not The waifu. You've gotta get me out of here. You know I can't do that. If I stay here. I'll die. Isn't that a bit melodramatic? Behind bars, I'm a sitting duck. This is as safe as it gets. Come on, Max. 
any one of these cops could be on the Inner Circle's payroll. You should know. What's that supposed to mean? You know Alfred Woden. You want answers? Call him. He'll verify everything I've told you. Okay, I'll do that. I didn't want to have anything to do with Woden. I should have called him the moment the Inner Circle was mentioned. The door to the station's garage was locked, except for when the perps were brought into custody. But it never lies. I mean, sure, I'd be okay if we had Hannibal Lecter in custody every night, as long as he'd keep his stomach contents to himself. Can I use your phone? There's one through the door behind you. You can use that. I need to make a call. You can use this phone. Play some hoops later on? Your funeral. You've reached the voicemail of Senator Alfred Woden. Please leave a message. Woden, Max Payne. We need to have a talk. You ask me, you still owe me. Oh, is that a a bomb? That was a bomb! Upstairs, now! <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> Upstairs, now! Something was off. Mona's words on her being a sitting duck kept playing in my head. The bomb had misdirection written all over it. Drop it! Oh! Armed perps in the lockup. Officer down! Take him down! Find the bitch! Find her! Kill her! NYPD! Drop your gun! Monda had been right. I had to go after her. I needed a gun to get past the cleaners. You know, ladies and gentlemen, this is completely random at the moment, but I've been thinking about playing a supposedly one of the best worst games ever made. R.I.P. to that guy doing the splits though. But a game called Kane and Lynch. It's like a third person game with two kind of cops who are going off the rails. A little bit like Max Payne, to be honest with you. I remember Seraphim17, one of my favourite YouTube um, personalities and just Let's Players and Twitch streamers these days talking about it oh shit oh fucking hell well there's actually two games and they're supposedly okay linear third person games I'm in the mood to play them and then found out that the first game isn't backwards compatible but the second game is what the hell well even if the story is not that amazing I want to play the first game not just the second so I don't know what I'm going to do. Uh, hello lads? Oh, fuck off. Could of course just probably play it on PC. Although no doubt it's a shit PC port, but... Yeah, some people say those games are pretty good and some people say they're awful. But I think playing Max Payne has just left me wanting... That kind of experience of a gritty third person game again. And I keep saying it, but I know this is a PS2, Xbox original era game, but the PS3, Xbox 360 era, Steam. I think it was a really good Trap era game in desk would have solved nothing. Mona had vanished into the night. Without her, I had nothing to go on. I knew where to find her. Vlad. Have no fear. Vlad is here. The world was getting too small for comfort. Too many coincidences. Bang! You're dead, Max Payne. A giant-headed Captain Baseball Bat Boy costume lay in the back seat. Gearing up for Halloween? Max, dearest of all my friends, call it my Trojan horse in the war of Inigognitistan. Speaking of which, any news? Do me a favor. Drop me off at Coney Island. Does the inner circle ring any bells? Nothing mystical about them. Even if they themselves would like to think so. Just one step up the ladder of organized crime. I see where you're going with this. Gogniti has made a deal with them. 
What about Mona Sachs? I know of her. Her reputation as a hired killer. I hear she is a stone fox. I would fuck her. Right then, I hated Vlad. Max, I need to ask your advice as a friend. Ask. Hypothetically, if the only choice you've got is to do the wrong thing, then it's not really the wrong thing. It's more like fate. You have to do what you have to do. It's never that easy. Of course. We agree to disagree. Why was I there again? Wait. Wait just a minute. Talk to me. What are you so afraid of? What do you want from me? The things that I want by Max Payne. The smoke, a whiskey, for the sun to shine. I want to sleep to forget, to change the past. My wife and baby girl back. Unlimited ammo and a license to kill. Right then, more than anything, I wanted her. here up to my place we can take them there shit and if i remember correctly this is is this where the game gets quite tough or tougher i went quite french though ladies and gentlemen this way oh this music's amazing holy shit Trouble with one, something like the fear of losing. Or never getting it. The thought makes you weak. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is where I'm going to end part four. See you in part five. Thanks for watching.